Here we go with today's mostly interesting. And do you know what a lemur sounds like? No, not last I checked. <laughs> well, check out this video from the Buffalo Zoo. familiar. <laughs> According to the Smithsonian Biology Institute, lemurs are some of the most vocal primates. They have a couple of different ways of communicating. <laughs> they meow when their group members are spread out. If they're feeling territorial, they howl. If they're alarmed, they grunt, wow. which then can turn into a bark. And to scare away other animals, they let out a series of grunts, and that's usually between two members of the group. Well, very serious looking creatures yeah. sometimes. I think he was howling. When, would you say that was a howl? It sounded like a howl. So he was alarmed. Well, I would be too if someone had a camera in my face. <laughs> but actually, oh! <laughs> Surprise it hasn't happened sooner. I know. Maria speaks fluent lemur. <laughs> yes, I can talk with the animals. <laughs> I believe it. Get a load of this. I saw this today. I said, are you kidding me? This is a close up. Uh, a very close-up encounter. This happened earlier this year, uh, this year in Africa, okay? It was a luxury safari following a pride of lions as they chased down a herd of Cape buffalo. Now, while everyone was busy watching the fight, a young lion snuck up behind the vehicle. Look at this guy's looking ahead and he didn't even see her. Like, whoa, hello, oh, yes. Uh, that gentleman there, his name is Eric, and according to the post, the lion was a meter, three feet away from Eric. Look at his, I know. <laughs> wow. The lion was watching the buffaloes from afar, and then after a while, the lion stepped away and laid down about 15 feet away. Eric was fine, the lion was fine. The Jeep seat had to be thoroughly cleaned. <laughs> That seems like typical cat behavior, doesn't it? Just, just sitting around staring at you and then just going to take a nap. He just kind of came up and was like, yeah. hi. And Eric's looking at it and I was like, I, I mean, to, compared to a buffalo, just not the same kind of lunch. It's like, well, I don't know about this guy. Oh, I know. I, what would you have done? <laughs> what would you have done? I don't know. I probably would not have thought about it until, like really thought about it till afterwards. You know what I mean? Like you would have had that moment of like, is this really happening? And then, yes. Once you took your head out of the lion's mouth, wow. you could reassess. It's so close, just stalking, you know? Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Wow. Still ahead today, everyone.